repurpose your video content to make social media posts? Well, with the power of AI, you can make reels, shorts, and TikTok ready videos in the blink of an eye. Let's check out Opus Clip and see how it can make your life a little easier. But first, my name is Michelle. I've been in the marketing game for close to 20 years, and I love to share what I've learned in the tools that I use with other entrepreneurs. Before we take a look at Opus Clip, if this info resonates with you or if it feels helpful, please give the video a like and subscribe if you'd like to see more videos like this one. And if you have any questions, you can leave those in the comments. Okay, let's take a look at how to harness the power of AI with no video editing skills required. Let's take a quick look at Opus Clip. So this is the perfect tool if you have like a podcast, if you do YouTube videos and you're looking to make clips, anything that's kind of like long form video format, all you have to do is drop in a video link and then it's going to clip it and it's going to add text overlays. It looks like we've got a new AI B-roll generator that it'll create for you as well. And so once you have that video link that you want to create into Eclipse, you can, you've probably seen this stuff all over the place and maybe didn't quite know how it was being generated, but it's all AI. So all those examples right there kind of show you what it's capable of. So my last YouTube video, actually, I put that link in and I generated a small clip. I'm gonna give you a sneak peek of what you can actually do with it once you are given those clips that are generated for you. So like I said, I entered in my last YouTube video and you know, I'll be honest, I was like with the format of my videos, it's probably not the best way to to view my videos in, in a vertical format. It does give you a score. It kind of like transcribes everything, kind of gives you, uh, you know, how engaging, how much of a hook does it have. It takes different portions of that. I actually thought it might just be easiest to go down to do the intro that I had and then just show the clip of the video kind of as a hook. So once you find one that you like, you can actually go into edit the clip. And then if there's any words that you need to fix, if it didn't transcribe something correctly, or even if you wanna go into the design aspect of things, you've got different caption styles, you can do different fonts, you can do different colors, you can do different caption transitions as you move through the video. And then you can also position it where you want you can control sort of font color, font stroke, all of that stuff, you have the ability to control. So I noticed that earlier when I was looking at this, I was like, it's kind of weird that it has a highlighter of green and yellow, and I'm not really sure why, but um, we'll just edit those. And so you can see, you can also edit the clip too, which if there's something in it that you don't quite like and you just wanna cut it out, you can do that. So it'll, you can preview it first. You can make a professional looking video, perhaps animate your logo or make a cool product promotion. I'm gonna show you a video template tool that I love and use quite a bit and it doesn't actually require any video editing skills. But first, if you're new here, my name is Michelle and I've been in the marketing game for close to 20 years now and I love to share what I've learned and the tools that I use with other entrepreneurs. Before we take a look at Video Bolt, if this info resonates with you or if you find it helpful, please give the video a like and subscribe if you'd like to see more videos like this one. And if you have any questions, you can leave those in the comments. Okay, let's make some cool videos. And so you can see the preview of that video. When it first generated it, you couldn't see the logo. And so you actually, when you click on it, I'm gonna hit video. pause here. When you click on the video, you can move it too. So. Keep that in mind too. So if you're doing like a podcast and you've got two different people who, that are talking and like they're slightly out of frame, you should be able to make those adjustments in how they're showing up. But this is a really easy way to generate these short form videos that you can use on your social media channels to promote your, whether it is your YouTube video or your podcast or anything that is your longer format just to hook people in. So something to keep in mind. I think it's pretty cool. Um, once you are good with it, you can save and compile and you then have the ability to download it once it finishes rendering, which it does take just a little bit of time. I will say when you initially upload your video, it does take 
it can take anywhere between, you know, a few minutes to maybe even up to 20. That was the kind of warning that it gave me. It was like, you're in line uh, and it's going to take about 20 minutes. And so just be patient with it. And then usually it'll say you can leave the screen if you want to. And then you'll receive an email when your videos are ready for review and they'll send you a link so that you can check those out. But once you've edited it, you can just hit the download button and then you have that asset for your disposal to use however you would like. And it didn't take too much brain power to do it. So if you wanna take a quick peek at pricing, they do have a free tier that you can check out. And I'm sure there's limitations with that, such as it will have a watermark. You can't have the ability to edit and your clips will no longer be available after three days only $9 a month if you want to have a little bit more capabilities and not have the watermark. And then it looks like at the time of making this video, they do have a sale going on. So normally it looks like $29 a month for the pro version, but um, a huge discount at the moment. So let me know what you think. Is this something that you're going to use? Uh, this could be a lifesaver if you're trying to create these clips without the power of AI. So if you have any questions, leave those in the comments. As always, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.